Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peak game. All right. Uh, Atlanta rapper Young Thug, if that's what you want to call him. Um, basically got into it with French Montana because French Montana said he wanted to do battle with Kendrick Lamar. And I guess Young Thug, I don't know the whole tale of the story, but I know the later half of the story. But it appears that Young Thug and French Montana got into it to where basically they've been flossing on each other. And now it's to the point to where Young Thug says that he's going to show the footage of Meek Mill knocking French Montana out. He said he's going to call Meek Mill and Meek Mill is going to send him the footage and he's going to put it out. So, well, here's my thing. Okay, so what is that going to do to French Montana? Look, if anybody listen to French Montana or even look at that dude, we could tell French Montana is not no tough guy. And really, to be honest with you, he don't even portray himself as that type of dude. He ain't a dude that get on on his records. He talk about, you know, you know, moving and shaking and all that kind of stuff. And he don't be talking about he beat the hell out of somebody. He don't even present himself like that. In my eyes, I don't even consider French Montana like a hip hop tough guy. Not that I'm saying that, you, you know, I'm just saying he's never like presented himself to me like that. Even when I've saw him in interviews and, you know, I've heard his, his raps and stuff and he all right as a rapper. But what is that going to do to his reputation? It's not like he got hella street cred as it is and Meek Mill as far as Meek Mill go I'm surprised that Meek Mill could knock anybody out as bad as Meek Mill boxing skills is because I've seen Meek Mill's attempt to box and it wasn't a pretty sight seeing him trying to hit a punching bag and, and Meek Mill's had absolutely no form I mean, nothing. I'll talk about... I'm just surprised that Meek Mill even landed a punch or swung at French Montana and actually connected to knock him out. So, nevertheless, I'm trying to figure out, like, what is that going to do? It's not like people going to stop listening to French Montana's records, you know, because this day and age, the dude to get knocked out seemed to be the dude that get get more credit because you know it seemed like shit is ass backwards now it seemed like we living in bizarro world i mean look what happened with uh that that mutt you know what i'm saying you know snitch nine you got some people congratulating him for being a snitch you know actually trying to justify him being a rat snitch bitch you know so I mean, at the end of the day, the game is just, like, real twisted. So, I, I, I mean, for real. And I've seen Young Thug tr trying to uh, box, too, and he didn't look too he didn't look too good his damn self. So, at the end of the day, man, I don't think this is going to hurt or help French Montana's career and footage sh show up of him getting slapped. Because, like I said, this is a new day and age now. This is the day and age where the cowards is per, uh, prevailing. The marks. You know what I'm saying? The suckers. Because Snitch 9 is a straight up sucker. You know, so I don't know, man. Let me know what you guys think. This is your boy Town Biz. I'm out.